Where are we going? We are going to your kidney specialist. Basically just to check in because thank God you haven't had to go to the hospital or have to see him. And it's been like two years so figure we should go in and show our faces and be like, hey what's up? Get a new prescription for pain medicine and just touch base so that if something does happen in the future. He's like, oh, I know her. Yes. It's not like, I haven't seen you in five years. So, just that. So, I've been writing down all my kidney stones. What kind of donut do you want? Um, a frosted right, donut. Out, out here. So, I wrote down all my kidney stones and, like, what side and the pain level and how long they lasted to, like, tell my kidney person. Doctor, guy, dude. So, you can put it in his file and do whatever he wants with it. But we're getting donuts on the way. <laughs> I asked her before we got out of the truck, should I bring the umbrella? Or should and I we risk was it? like, nah. She said no. Guess what? It's now raining. It's like raining <laughs> yeah, but I don't really care, but she does. You know what? It's because I already, okay, I'm not even exaggerating. I had to go to the, um, the place where you return, you can return empty bottles like in bulk. And we had over 600 yeah, between our bottles Whoa. and cans that we've been saving for months and months. And I had to keep going, you know, from the truck to the building, truck to the building, and I already got really wet. And well, my, then this should be a piece of cake! My hair is already, like, very crunchy from wet and then dry hairspray, and I just really didn't want to get wet again. But Are you ready? Unless we're going to wait here forever. Are you ready? We've already tried wait. No! I've already tried waiting here for like probably over five minutes already and it's just not letting out. And we're parked kind of far away. So I guess we're just going to have to go for it. We are wearing flip flops though and that is good. Alright, that's when this person passes we'll go. But are I'm going to be hurrying. Are we get, hold on to me so oh I stay with you. This is going to be great. I'm going to try to cover my head a little bit. Oh my god. Wait a second. What? I have bank papers in this purse. Let me turn my purse the other way. Oh my oh, gosh. Oh, this purse has like holes in it too. This is probably not a good idea. Yet yeah, you're going to do it anyway? Yes, I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> you better not tell dad. Shh. <laughs> Alright, you ready? Nobody tell dad. <laughs> go, 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 go. Oh, I can't go that fast. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like a chart of like all my kidney stones and um which he was very pleased with he liked it and he was like we just like talked and went over like general stuff and then he wanted to get an x-ray of my abdomen 
abdomen to see if there's like any kidney stones in there. Just like chilling, you know? So I got an x-ray done. Um, and then, so the guy goes, I have to ask, is there any chance of you being pregnant? And I was like, no. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's so funny, because like, I keep having people ask me if there's any way I'm pregnant and when I'm like doing stuff for my kidneys. Because like, the last time somebody asked that was when I was in the hospital. And they were like, just so you know, you're not pregnant. She <laughs> like, thanks. thanks. So, we did that, and she's going to call up, like, in a few weeks and be like, hey, what's, like, the results of the x-ray and whatever the heck? No, yeah, just to see if there's any stones in there, because there's none bothering her right now. So, it would be interesting to find out if... There's, like, ones chilling in there, yeah, or no? Yeah, like, there's ones waiting in there, or is she empty? So we would find that interesting to know, so I'll call and ask, but other than that, like, we don't have to do anything else, just... I'm gonna keep, like, tracking my kidneys, though. Kidney stones. And he liked all of my colorfulness. Yes, he did. <laughs> so, that's basically what happened at my kidney appointment. And I'll probably do, like, another video explaining this but the reason that I go to a kidney doctor and have kidney stones is because I have this rare disease thing called medullary spongy kidney disease so I'm special basically and it was something she was born with not like it didn't happen from anything I did or she did or anything that happened so, to her I was born with it just a thing just a thing that I have Lucky me. So, so now we're gonna go home. If you guys watched my live stream that I did, um, I went live earlier today and I did this makeup. So if you're wondering about this makeup, go watch my live. We are going home to have a Father's Day barbecue dinner, even though it's not Father's Day. And it's pouring rain. It's pouring rain. Which I told you. I even said on my live, I was like, you know, I told my mom, I was like, you know, it's supposed to, like, rain, right? It's supposed to be letting up, like, literally right about now, so... Yet, yeah, it's not! No, I am aware. I am <laughs> wet, I am aware. Same. So, we're going home, we're gonna barbecue in the rain, I guess. He was happy to hear that I ate lots of fruit. Yes, he was. Can't say the same for vegetables. I eat some vegetables, but I'm bigger on fruit. I eat a lot of fruit. I like a lot of different fruit, except I don't like melons. I mean, yeah, we have um, peas and carrots. We and discovered corn. cauliflower rice. If you've never tried it, do you get it in like the frozen section? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go to the frozen section and try cauliflower rice because it doesn't sound good, but it's really <laughs> good. But you gotta put butter and pepper at least. Which there. makes it less like salt too, healthy, actually. but it does taste good. It's sweet, <laughs> but good. So and you like broccoli too, broccoli. Oh yeah, I like broccoli. So you're not a I like carrots, either. broccoli, peas, corn. That's not really that good for you. Potatoes. That's also not really that good for you. I like spinach. I like salads. I only, I don't really like light green things in salad. I like the dark green <laughs> stuff. That's why, like, on the cruise, I would cut off a bunch of the stocky things and the light green stuff. But yeah, that's the gist of today and everything. That's, like, why we had to come home, because we had doctor's appointments. So, you, she got her blood taken today. Oh, yeah. So. You know what? The, the, having the blood taken was not bad. But tearing the, look at that, tearing the, the medical tape off look at that. afterwards was worse than having. That's terrible. Drawn. I know, it hurt really bad. They used to put band-aids on, but now they use, she used, you know, medical tape. And Rip what, off. Was that sticky? Yeah, we were saying, so she was saying how um her blood drawer was like really good and like skilled oh, this, at it. It's the fastest I've ever had it done in my life. <laughs> and that she was saying. Was, Next Oops. time I gotta get my blood drawn, she's gonna ask for like their best blood drawer. Because... The optimist. Okay, sure. So, 
because when I get my blood drawn, I have to lay down. Otherwise, I'm at risk for fainting. And last Even time... Even while laying down. Yeah, I can faint while laying down. So, I'm like a skilled fainter. So, last time I got my blood drawn, I was so good until they started, like, messing around. And then I fainted. And then they had to call my doctor over the loudspeaker. Oh, it was and a then whole thing. She Everyone almost was running fainted. In. It was very exciting. And then I was getting better while she was like nearly fainting, and I was hysterically laughing because I thought that was the funniest thing ever. It's a whole thing. So she's gonna ask for a good blood drawer when I need to get my blood drawn, whenever the heck Give that me your next best time is. Phlebotomist. So that's what happened today. And then tonight we're going back up to our cabin, but just us. Not my father, because he has pets. work. Yeah, we're All taking the pets. the pets. So, yeah. And, like, it's been so hot out. Like, horribly hot and humid and disgusting and gross and nasty and just, ugh! So, I'm happy we're going up north. And I'm less allergic up there. So, looking forward to being less allergic, because I've had a headache since we've got home here. Because I'm just really allergic here. So... There you go.